Hey internet, Eric here. Uh, back with Bloody Sunday. You know, obviously it's kind of hard to do these every Sunday, so I'll just do them whenever I can. Um, basically what the plot is, Sundays, if you decide to do a Bloody Sunday video, you discuss a specific death in a movie, TV show, film, whatever, any type of media. You pick one of those, pick a specific death and just talk about it. Um, and I've been recently going through the Hannibal Lecter movies, and I figured why not talk about a death from Hannibal? Now, obviously... This is going to be a spoiler-filled video, plots, you know, because I'm talking about someone's death. So, you have your warning now. The death I'm talking about from Hannibal is Mason Verger. He is played by Gary Oldman, and you cannot fucking recognize that man in this movie. Um, the basic, then let's just tell you the scene here. Hannibal has been, Mason Verger is one of the, if not the only victim of Hannibal that has survived. And he is horribly disfigured because he was got he, he got drunk and high with Hannibal one day, and Hannibal convinced him to slice off his own face and feed those pieces of his face to his dogs. So Hannibal or so Mason has been scouring the earth trying to find any type of paraphernalia related to Hannibal, and he has finally captured Hannibal at this point in the movie. Hannibal is brought out there in a giant barn. And what Mason has been doing is he's been training, he has been paying some people to, how would you say, I don't know if they're pigs or actual boars, but basically train boars to like the taste of flesh so he can feed Hannibal to these uh, animals. Well, Hannibal is kidnapped. He is taken to this barn. He's strapped up like fucking Jesus. Uh, Julianne Moore, who is now playing Chloe Starling, she shows up, helps Hannibal get out, and... She shoots one of the, she shoots one of the, I guess you would say helpers of Mason. She gets shot. So the rest of it is, you know, Hannibal is carrying, picking her up. And what's happening, you know, people are dying left and right. Pigs are eating some of them. And as Hannibal carrying a, uh, an injured um, Clarice, he's walking out. He up comes Mason Verger. Mason is, I think he's, he's, a, he's, uh, I don't know if he's paraplegic or not, but he's in a wheelchair. And behind him is his manservant, Cordell. And Cordell, through this whole movie, has just been treated like dog shit. You know, do this for me, Cordell. Do that for me, Cordell. You know, you the whole nine yards. So as Hannibal is walking away, like I said, with, with the injured uh, Clarice, um, Mason is yelling at Cordell to shoot Hannibal. Shoot him. Stop him. You know, that whole that whole thing. And Cordell does not want to get involved. He does not want to be involved with shooting Hannibal, getting Hannibal mad, possibly hitting um, Clarice. So in wonderful fashion, Hannibal turns around and he says, Hey, Cordell, why don't you push him in? You know, push him into the little area with the, uh, with the, the boars or the pigs. He says, why don't you push him in? You can always say it was me. And then... Cordell's gears start turning and he does he starts to slowly push Mason forward and Mason cannot stop it he's got these electric he's got an electric uh uh wheelchair and he's 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 going nowhere but forward and then off he goes off he goes tumbles down face first bam and it's a rough fall we get this close-up shot of his fucking disfigured face his eyeball and then he is being surrounded by all these wild animals, these boars or pigs or whatever. And they start chewing the hell out of him. We have close-ups of them going for his throat, tearing him apart. Ridley Scott directed this, so he, it, it's really good, you know, shaky cam. And close-ups of the neck and the blood and the, the eyes of, of Mason as he is just devoured. Um, and then it ends, the whole scene ends with Hannibal walking away from the camera shadow just a silhouette of him silhouette of him carrying this fallen injured um clary starling so it's a short scene but it is cool seeing mason get it because mason is just a despicable despicable human being in this i understand it's revenge for for what hannibal did to him but he is just a piece of garbage and it's a cool death scene it's cool to see that it was cordell Finally sticking up for himself and getting rid of this this creature of a man, I guess you would say. And then, of course, Hannibal chewing the scenery. You can always say it was me. Loved it. 
So I chose Mason Verger's Death from Hannibal. And uh, that's it. Highly recommend that movie. It's underrated. I think, again, because it followed up the almost damn near perfect Silence of the Lambs. But uh, highly recommend Hannibal. Hannibal. I'll get to it eventually, you know, for a full review. That's it. Like and subscribe. Tell me what you thought of this death. If you have seen it, did you like it? Did you hate it? Feel free to participate in Bloody Sunday. It's it's fun. Do it when you can. Videos don't have to be long. I'm rambling like I normally do. Cheers.